Welcome to Happy Hour, brought to you by Best Damn Bookkeeping. So, Rob, if April's coming along, mm-hmm. probably going to be, is it, are you going to, like, between March and April, even with last year, ahead of last year? Uh, last year, I felt like you had a bunch of, like, team rebuilding stuff, so it kind of caused you to get out of the gate slow. Like, Most of that, like, June was when, like, all the sh- shit hit the fan, and okay. we had to turn over, like, everybody, um, and then built a whole new team for second half of July, or June, all of July and August, and then, like, all gone again. Like, we literally just, it was bad. Um, Do you, is that a... Uh... Are you just struggling to find like the right manager person that can keep them or what do you think is causing it? The, I don't know. I had like three or four people all leave for different reasons at the same time. Um, We'd gotten to a point with my service manager that for his own sake, he needed to move on. Um, He had some personal stuff going on too. And, and, you know, granted that's, that's why I look at it. Like I don't, I'm sure there are things that I could have done differently, um, but also we haven't found his replacement yet or a a successful replacement. But yeah, getting somebody in that position to help us grow from one to two to three million um, and beyond, it's you know it's just a different person. That's a tricky. You know? That's a tricky role. Yeah, I mean it's it's it certainly evolves, and some people are able to evolve into it. And I think that he just quite frankly had a lot of stuff going on that needed to um i think he, he moved out of state like he needed to it, it, it was good for that we had a guy get a job in the oil fields a guy um that really liked him he just kept having callbacks and like it wasn't lack of trying it was just he just dumb have- thing after dumb thing after dumb thing and they you know they had a kid he had gone on an in, uh, interview already with a plumbing company and it's a good plumbing company. They got a great culture and great vibe and whatnot. And he left and um, I had another guy who's, you know, moving back home and it was like, well, and the, the guy who was going through nursing school and it was like, I didn't understand why the guy who was going through nursing school was even still here. It's like, dude, you yeah. should be doing something medical related. Like, yeah, I won't, yeah. I won't fault you at all. Anything. Like, Anything. Yeah, screwing in light bulbs is not advancing your career. Go get some rips. like whatsoever. No, um, the most of what I brought on for the summer was, um, I would say, more desperation. Um, the old dumpster hires. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, and we had our we had our biggest project ever in July. Um, you know, collective experience was like a month to two months per person. Um, it was hot. It was a mess. Uh, lots of stuff going on. Hey, Home Service Heroes. Thank you guys so much for tuning into our Home Service Happy Hour content today. I sure hope you learned a little something. And I sure as a heck hope that it was entertaining. If you did find it fun and entertaining, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel for more cool, fun, entertaining business content. And speaking of which, stay tuned. There's a little more here and a little more right here. Check it out.